I've been struggling for the past 10 minutes. To find a picture to post on Instagram and I'm still unsuccessful. This morning I opened the store. So I'm like a minute away and it's like um five minutes to no or like eight minutes to 9 30 but um i'm opening this morning and i have a rather long shift today which i'm not too thrilled about as everybody may know but i'm hopeful that it's gonna go smoothly and nobody's gonna like piss me off and i'm gonna get enough food to, so i have enough energy to go throughout the day but i'm hopeful and i'm positive I work with the new girl today and so far she's pretty decent so I'm looking forward to like a smooth couple of hours before Brittany comes in oh, later on I have some stuff that I need to do like get some download some music and stuff like that for my vlogs because I feel like I'm tired of the music that I do have but I'm at work now so later so it took me a hot little minute to realize this, but everybody has a story. Sometimes your story isn't the best, but everyone has one nonetheless. And it's important to have one. Um, and I'm just in shambles today. Uh, my hair is two weeks old and I feel like taking it out. But yesterday when I was at work, everybody was like, no, it still looks fine. And I'm just like, okay, I guess. And it's not even itching because I've really been using the Stop It, which is working. I must admit, initially when I bought it, I'm just like, damn, I probably just wasted some money on this shit that's not even going to work anyways. But it really does work. So now I'm caught between, do I really want to take them out or do I want to keep them for an additional week and then take my hair out afterwards? Or do I want to just take them out now, wash my hair and just be done with it? Um, conclusion, I really don't know what I want to do. However, I know that right now I'm about to go shower because I'm supposed to go do some laundry today. And, um, yeah, any minute now my father-in-law could call me and tell me that he's on his way to come get me because to go do the laundry, he normally gets me because, um, I normally do it on my day off, one, because it's just better to do it on your day off than to do it one night when you come home from work, eight o'clock, no. If, if the laundry um, was in the apartment or whatever, then that would have been fine, but it's not, so that's not an option. Especially now that it's so cold and not even that too, like Dwayne comes home dumb late, so. Well, who's gonna go do it after a certain time to, no. So the only other option is to go on the day where I'm off or where I'm going in late. Today, I'm off, so. Um, I'm gonna go do it today but that's pretty much all i have planned for today um i want to go and see how quickly i could get that done i wanted to go from super early but i'm working off his timing because i'm asking him to drop me there so he has to like see what time he has available in his day and then drop me there which you can't really make any plans around that but um i've also been like applying for jobs because trying to get a second job and um, so there's that. And I could do that like really quickly in the mornings because I do it on care or on Indeed. So um, I like wake up and before I have to go to work or after I'm finished doing all I have to do and I have like 20 or 30 minutes to play around with before I have to leave for work, then I'd use the time, that time to do that or just at night so when I come home. Last night I was applying to a few, yesterday I applied to a few and um, yeah. So now I'm about to go shower and be partially ready so that when he comes, all I have to do is like put some pants on and be ready to go. But uh, today, it gotta be done today because it's been maybe two or three weeks because I don't, I work every single day. So I don't, I don't have that much stuff that's dirty. So the first week it wasn't even worth going because the bag was tiny. The second week it was still small, but then like after that it started getting bigger because now jeans are in there and um a jacket and all that crazy stuff probably 
sh sheet is there towel you know that stuff after a week or two so um now it's getting a little bit bigger and i'm gonna have to go do it but i'm gonna go shower i have one bro i did my nails and a customer a difficult customer that i was helping this one broke off and then because i couldn't get to go um refill the rest of them the other night this hand normally grows out like around the cuticle area normally grows out so much quicker on this hand and that's probably because this is my more dominant hand and i pretty much use it for everything if i'm gonna use one hand and the more water you use the quicker your nails need to be refilled and stuff and because around the cuticle area was the part that's lifting i didn't want water to settle underneath there and discolor my nails so i just decided to completely pick these ones up so now it's all types of rachicity going on so this hand is done and this one has no nails so i need to figure out what i'm gonna swing by Brittany real quick and go do them maybe later today maybe later tonight but i'm also trying not to spend too much money and i got an uber to get there okay so i don't want to spend too much money because i have some shit that i gotta do